Je suis tombé sur des étoiles. Il y a bien peine. Ah, les a fait un dead. You know, say charge the phone dead, never charge on it, never. Mm -hmm. Good evening, Planka Shop. Good evening. I might put you here watch that. So me I hear my mouth. At uh, Opal. Oh yeah, watch Chrissy. She dead on live? A dead live. You see how people love watch me? Tats love watch Chrissy. How oh, make you love watch Chrissy, so Tats? Tats love watch Chrissy. Chrissy, big up yourself. Tats obsessed with Chrissy. Yes, guys, what's up, Planka Shop? So, tomorrow I'll let them again, no? Ask that Jay with them, the teen and them in there. All right, so all of the parents here. Eh? I'm going to tell them if I have a look at something. So, I want all of the students, them, all of the parents, them. And if you don't in need, don't call. I may go call it out by school. So, Claudia, they have our pen and paper right here. So, I go call it out by school. So, when I call and say, one student from that school must call. A, a that student I go call. And, me, and next week one day I go have the giveaway, but I get the names them now. So I don't want nobody come bungle up a 99 or come a 99. No, two different bags. Two different bags is there. Tina just build no middle on the life. Two different there. Now look again, one next one there. Home. Yeah. Um. So, I never, me never have no back to school drive this um time, guys, cause when I say COVID. Um. When I say COVID come in and mash up every little thing, so. But they want, me never did a, me never did a plan to have no back to school um, treat when me give stuff. But I have some bag here and some book and couple of tablets. I want to ask questions before me give them out and choose the child name. Yeah. Or, and the, the laptop with the man give me a country. Yeah. So. I don't like jump to look away. Now what is this? I'm sorry, I thought I missed it now. I thought I give me this too. All of them, I don't know what they like. Yes. Oh, Big Daddy did give me that. Let me give the little girl one. And the next one, the third one. Pass them, give me them. Pass the next one. Who that? So I want to run up all of the school children them. Not all of them. Because we have, may I tell you how much tablet I have. So them three tablets here. I go. Somebody did get Carol them here from last year, forgive me. And I get them and the person never give name. Do you know? I don't know anti dynasty. I don't know give it a good and a willing heart. I don't know send nothing here come and give out no name, I don't give it out. See, they know Carol says she don't know how to get them. Post them to her. Three Samsung tablets. I have them. Well, I go give them weapon on the live. Not tonight, I just show one of them. So nobody, nobody will come here in the laptop for me. Big Daddy, give me. I don't know how to bring this. You know. How to bring this? Somebody else, give me this. I don't know how to trust me. Sophia just left one of the things. And now, nah, let's not name. Don't do it. I did money to that stay till it wrapped me. Somebody again bring this. See, tell me I give them where? Back to school. Oh, she could buy from. No, them now get. Somebody else get already. A different thing, I did for you now. This again, I don't remember who give me. I don't remember if 
I know who give me up, I don't remember, because then Kyrie didn't come give me and say I have to give it out. And then your two kids come to, and Big Daddy and his wife send this, but they give the little girl one. Look how they're not in for me. Oh, I'm, I'm going to get them three cases. I don't know what I Let me ask the tablet more than I have a leap of bungalow. But you may have to deal with my business. I never ask. So, I have a... How much? 53? 53? 55? 54. And the tap, I'm past this day. And this laptop... But the man give me a country. Put it down for me. To give away. Currently, I have $54,000 from Mobile where she did send for teeth. I went to um, you know, teeth people. She tell me something to do something with it. So I go, go to the bookstore and take out grant. School grant where you can go, they go take. I give each student 10 10000 And a book list it I go to. We're not paying no school fee this year. So, lockdown has come. I'm going to try to do it not one day next week before the funeral. So, anybody else want to give me a $10,000 grant to give a child to go to the bookstop? You know? Bookshop. Bookshop. We're going to use Book Depot. They're going to, them going to send Auntie Dana the money. Auntie Dana is going to go and buy the vouchers. And show it on here. Each voucher means $10,000. This is how I'm doing it this year. And two time I go on a lockdown because you know so it's Sunday I should have did it, but two me say I want to get it out because I want to do something. So pack up back this and I go do a little bit for the something this Sunday. Alright, so how much tablet you have Tina? One laptop, 53,000. Pack them up back. Oh, six tablet, one laptop. 53,000. You know, Auntie Dana can carry to all a million dollars if we want, right? We would like that over here. So we're going to give vouchers. So if the vouchers, you can go to the bookstore and go ask about the book people then for go no money. The vouchers is only for book lists. You understand? Only for book Please. Right? So Marlon, you know you always a support Auntie Dana. Marlon, Ferran and all of them. We're giving away grants. Inbox me your number. Alright. But for that now, you're not going to get me anymore. You're going to have to call Paula to deal with that. We're going to deal with that specifically. Because we can't leave out the children them. And every year I do something for the children them. I don't know that. Last year I pay a school fee. The year before that, I um, me, me, me do treat, so I me, me change it up. So we're going to give away vouchers. No cash for nobody come here come war over. Um, or no cash, no voucher for nobody go tell the book people them say they nobody want no book. And we not pay no school fee. Alright? School officially going to open in September. And although it's, it's, it's gadgets using, we're back to school because as we said in the right now the new norm the new norm is online schooling for now until we get this covid thing under control, control right so um your grant the digi loan <laughs> we don't have any digi loan go on go pay off your loan how would that no we don't grant loan over here so the first school tonight that we're gonna give away a ten thousand dollar voucher, to, voucher to, and if it's only if you need it, the first person to call Auntie Dana, the first student to call Auntie Dana from Merle Grove High School, will be getting ten thousand dollar voucher from Book Depot. So anybody, any student that call me from Merle Grove. You will be the, I'm picking school randomly in Kingston area. Alright, so the first person to call from Merle Grove gonna get a ten thousand dollar voucher. So we're not giving nobody voucher and tablets. 
Or we have some books. We have a lot of books. The books them, when we tear out the page out of write up, I get enough of them for write. Every minute somebody send them come for me write up. So I go and give a lot of them away. You understand? Hard cover book and the book them with the something. So we're going to give out those. And we did have some school bags from last year. When we did get, so we're going to give them out also. It's not a lot. And we have pencil. And we'll leave a look at other something we're going to give out. We have them there from last year. When we did have back to school. And we did have only pay school fee because we did have beer. Somebody had called already. So Hello, good night. Yes. Um, it has to be from Mergrove. Yes. I'm going to ask specifically. Um, I want to be the first person who called from Merle Grove to be the first winner. So please listen to what I said. If, if you don't go to Merle Grove, don't call, all right? Yes, that is how we're doing it. When donors give me their money, I have to oblige what them say. If them say choose Merle Grove, choose Dovecat, choose Medores, or choose Excel, I may have to do that. Money is not my one. I only have it in my hand. And them say choose Merle Grove that what? Merle Grove as the first school. So if you don't go to Merle Grove, don't call when I call it out. Good night. Hello. You see if you're not shy, don't call. And you know, don't tell me what you no know get. I give you know what you no know must get. Hello, good night. Hello. Hi, good evening. I am yes, good evening. What go on here, so? hmm. What we waiting on the first student from Merle Grove to call. It does not matter where you live as long as you can come for it. Hello, you call back. Good evening. Yes, good night. Wanna turn off the phone, please? Good night. You are a Merle Grove student? Yes, I'm Stella. What farm are you in? Third. I'm going to third farm. Okay. Uh, oh, oh. You're, you're in third farm. I can't ask you what your teacher name because I don't know the teacher them. Um, let me give her a, a, a Merle Grove quiz. Any Merle Grove students in the planker shop tonight? All right. Because I didn't put out any stipulations, I didn't ask, tell you that I was going to ask any questions for it. I'm going to give you the first $10,000 um, vouch, um, voucher. What is your name? So you have to bring, when you're coming for it, you have to bring your, your school ID for Auntie Dana to see that you go to Merle Grove, right? My ID is it. You don't get no ID? No. Everybody that goes to Merle Grove. Everybody that goes to Merle Grove have an ID. Everybody that goes to Merle Grove have an ID, just like Excelsior. Every school have an ID. So you can't tell me so you don't get the ID you're in third form. Want to first form ID? Yes, I was in first form. I took a picture and I got signature. I a signature for it, but I didn't get it. I received it as you. Are you going to second farm? Are you don't? Are you don't have any ID in second farm either? Third farm. Huh? Yes, I'm going to third farm. Yes, so what happened to second farm ID? No, I didn't get any last time. Okay, what is it? What is the principal for Merle Grove name? Doctor Marjorie Fullerton. Dr. Marjorie Fullerton, um, let me say some question. Um, no, this may not feel like me. Why would the she not get an ID? Second farmer would have been at the Corona, as mm -hmm. Claudia said. Um, you know, give me some more. Tell you, they never give me no more growth question, you know. You have to pay to get your ID? No, I did a package, mm, package but I didn't receive the ID. Oh, so you did a package but you didn't receive the ID. 
Okay, what no. is your name? You, you, you have any proof to show me that you go to Merle Grove when you come? You have picture in your uniform? Yes, I have a picture. Supposed in, to. In your uniform? I can show you my uniform. No, man. <laughs> Alright, what is your name? Write down your name. I'm going to write down your number. Just your first name. Don't give out everything on the phone. Write down your number. Yes, just write that. We're going to write down your name, your first name. I'm, I'm writing down your. Is this your number? Yes, I'm All right, I'm going to interrogate you. Yeah, All right, this is your number. And your, your name again? Repeat. What's your name again? Shavina. All right, Shavina. All right, you're going to get a call from Auntie Donna. You hear? Santa Donna. All right. All right, so um, Auntie Dana is gonna randomly choose schools now to get that tablet. I'm gonna ask question for some. So the next school we we'll go to Merle Grove. I could choose the next school. Now looking at for the cabinet. <laughs> okay. Mona High School. How could I forget Mona? Mona High School. We're taking a student from Mona High School. So somebody from Mona, please call Auntie Donna. Mona High School. All right. So I remember Auntie Donna wants to see some form of proof. And if you are not a student right now, please don't call. All right, we're taking the call from the students them now to give out the tablet. Let me hear. All right. Hello, good evening. She, um, let me see what this person is saying. Yes, good evening. Yes. Huh? You're not interrogating the kids that call, right? But another person is going to call and read it. Right, so you have to have proof. Yeah, that is why. I'm Everybody's supposed to have a picture in like a uniform that the girl is going to say, baby. She's not going to turn from, she's going to say, yeah. She's going to say, probably, if I have a picture in uniform, she's going to come and show you. Yeah, she has. Yeah, if, 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 guess what? When I call her, even her school report, she have to bring it. And some for my ID. I remember yeah. Auntie Dana know a lot of people, and even the person that um giving me money to give out no person from the schools so i can get information by the tip of an iceberg so if she, that is why i said i'm not interrogating any children no? so whatever they tell me they must be truthful because when i take the names i will find out i'm gonna call them and find out everything about the child if they are lying to me because you know people will set them up and say yeah man so you go at this at school and say you go at that so they must have some form of proof, a report. And you know? Yes. Yes, yes, definitely. All right. Yeah, man, thanks. Yeah, good idea. Thank you. So we're going to take somebody from the Chicalin back. Yes? Mm -hmm. Good night, Auntie Donna. Yes. My daughter just called in a while ago. She got the marble. But I don't want them to be bashing because she's crying because she's crying right now. That because, is why I said um, that is why I said I don't want any if you want to see if you want to see the uniform and the report, you can see because Listen, hold on a second. Hold on. That is why I said I am dealing with um, children now. We don't want to interrogate them. I mean, I want nobody to come and say anything on here. That is why I don't take all our names either. I just take the number. So tell her don't cry. Until then, I'm going to have our, our thing here for her. I just want some sort of proof. Can you know some parents this honest? Because, it's because of the COVID. Because from first no, form, man, I'm not saying that she um, is. She has been out of school from first form. All right. Yes, yes. When you come, I will talk to you after. And man. she's a child. 
Yeah, she's like she's only 13 years old, so I don't know why the people them doing that in the comments. Alright, don't read the comments. Please be nice in the comments. Alright, I remember we're dealing with children. Alright, remember for children. Yes. Yeah, and parents, please be there with them when them call, alright? Alright, so I'm right. Okay, I'm right. Yes. Somebody said I have to call schools from the ghetto. A lot of ghetto picnic go to high schools. So I am doing it my way. So we want somebody from Mona High School. So don't tell me cause school from the ghetto. Cause most high school them now full up a ghetto. Okay, here cause ghetto have here too. Good evening. Good, good night, Auntie Dana. Yes, good night. What school you go to? Turn off the phone. Okay, Auntie Dana. Yes, good night. A long time me, me ask if you help me, you know. I chew me tell us and my mother did they think I like me at tell. I'm all the same girl. From where? I'm all. Run out with me. Run out with me. I'm from Run out with me. It's call it all. And you talk to me, boy? Yes, Auntie Donna. And what me tell you, sir? Uh, yes, I will be text you. I always. Eh? I me always wish that for you come. And you always wish God for me come? Yes, Auntie Donna. More about me not remember you. I talk to thousands of people. Yes, yeah, somebody I whisper in my background. Tell them when I whisper in time, you know. How would that? Who are we spotting, boy? I'm me, Auntie Dana and Grandmother. Please, Auntie Dana, listen to me. Let me talk to you. Well, I'm... <laughs> Make the little girl go back on the phone, Grandma. Go on back on the phone. Talk to you now, here. Moi. What do you say, Auntie? Yes, Auntie Dana. How old are you? Eighteen. Oh, I'm thinking, so what? So what school you got tomorrow? Eh? Yeah, you school. I leave school now, Auntie Dana. Okay. Well, we're dealing with students now in school. You hear, Moy? Auntie Dana, I want to go to heart, but my grandmother don't have any money. You know, if I forgot to heart, Moy. No want things to go like uniform and things to go. I'm gonna add a whole art guy again. I'm here to beg you, please. I'm here to beg you. You sign up, forgot to art. You have to sign up, forgot to art in a moy. But I'm not hearing so well. Oh, you have a hearing problem? Yes, Auntie Dana. So, yeah, hear me now. Stick with me ears. Me two of the ears there. Oh, so why you want to go to art and do? Housekeeping. Okay, so what? Wh where you live? Scarlet Mama, make sure talk. No, make sure talk. Eh? Scarlet it all, Auntie Donna. Like when you come in to run away, babe. Scarlet all. All right, so you, you apply at art already? No, Auntie Dana. You have to apply it, yeah, all right. When you got, is there an art into your community? Auntie Dana. Yeah? Uh, HP, me do, me do have any HP apply. Wow. What? So you never go to school? Yes, Auntie Dana. I can't number our file. Hello? So, oh, yeah, go, go. Okay. you have got. You're doing your subjects then? Okay. Imoy? Yes, Auntie Dana. Okay. You're doing your subjects then? Okay. Yes, Auntie Dana. Uh, how much subjects you get? Come on, I think I'll take you with certain. Oh, oh, how much subjects you get? Grandma, make the little girl talk to me now. Stop whisper. What you say, boy? 
Are you? No, she I hear me clearly, Grandma. Just leave her alone. Where you say, Moy? Moy, Grandma, leave Moy alone. No, please, let me talk to Moy. Moy, where you say? What you say, Auntie Donna? How much subjects you get? So I can see if I can facilitate you with art. No, Auntie Donna. You don't get any subjects? No, Auntie Donna. Oh. If, if she doesn't have no subject, no oh, art there. And then you have to apply. You have to, have to go around to art, Moy, and you have to apply. Then you have to do a test. You have to do a test, and you pass the test. But if you don't pass it, then we send her to somewhere. But if you don't pass it, then we send her to somewhere. Auntie Donna. Eh? You just want me to eat for your class. All right, Moy. I people, know people are RGD. Hold on. I'm going to take your number, you hear? Take your number. Auntie Donna. Hold on, boy. I'm going to take your number. I'm going to, first thing I'm going to see if I can get your, your, your birth paper for you. Yes, you, know your, Auntie Donna. you know your date of birth and your mother details and everything? Yes, Auntie Donna. Thank you very much. All right, boy. Come in where you can hear Auntie Donna clearly. All right. Yes, Auntie Donna. Yes. Auntie Donna, I need you to call you to see me. Please, I beg you. <laughs> All right, Moe. Make we, make we deal with the birth paper first. One step at a time. Yes, Auntie Donna. Right here, number one, right. Moe birth paper. So I remember. Write it for this. I don't want to write it. That's how I blow it. Auntie Donna, I have my age paper. All of my father name is not on it. All right, so, so I'm going to call you and get the info because I know persons from RGD who can assist me with getting you your birth paper. All right, Auntie Donna, thank you very much and God bless you. All right, Moy. Yeah. All right. Later. Yeah. Parents, please, when the children them calling, I don't want any parents sitting back at them and tell them what they say because Moy, Moy grandmother said Moy can't hear. And from what I am seeing, Moe is hearing me clearly. So let them speak for themselves. All right? Yes, good night. Hello, good night. Yeah. Auntie Dana. Hi, good night. Auntie Dana here. Yes, this is Claudette Francis. I'm um, calling about my daughter. My daughter got to free you with. We just took in a laptop for her. No, it don't go like this, Miss Claudette. Please do not call in. I will give the questions and then persons call in. All right, I only have one laptop, so I will give questions when I reach to the laptop, and then you call in. Are you ready? Okay. All right. Thank Claudia, you. I forgot go well with me. Give me pen and the paper. That's curfew time. All right? So we need somebody from, um, this is girl for the birth paper. Let me circle. From Mona High School. How can I leave out Mona? And my daughter goes to Mona. Used to go to Mona. Hello, good night. Good night, Auntie Dana. Where Oh, Meryl Grove. Yeah, good night. Good night, Auntie Dana. Hi, what's your name? What is that fly for me? Anne Miche. Anne Miche? Yes, Auntie Dana. And what school you go to? Where's your parents? Okay, and Michelle, tell mommy that we're going. We, we're at Mona High School now. Oh, yeah. All right, Auntie Dana. Okay, thank you. All right, Auntie Dana. All right, yes. Only if you go to Mona High School. Hello, good night. Hello, good night. Yes, good night. Good night. I am I'm Tamika. I'm calling on behalf of my children. Yes. Are you hearing me? Yes. Yeah, I'm calling on behalf of my children. I would like one of the, at least one of the tablets. I don't have four children. I'm not expecting four. It is even Okay, one. Tamika, did you watch me from a start the live? Let me explain. I'm doing this different. This is not a calling where you can just call in and get the tablets. Um, don't yeah. donate them to me. We had a discussion, so I told them I, I want to do it. Yeah, I want to do it different. Yes, um, yes, I'm, I'm going by schools, so I am at Mona High School, so if you don't go to Mona, you cannot call. I'm, I'm, I'm oh, okay, okay, darling. All okay. right, yes. 
So a student from Mona who is in need of a tablet, please call Auntie Dana. And remember, all the gadgets that I have, I did not buy them. They were donated to me. So I don't want to know, get them to find any fault and stuff. I want to get a bag and some books and stuff when they come. All right? So we're, we're giving a $10,000 voucher to the student from Merle Grove. Remember, she's getting 10000 So let me write it so that I know. All right? If you don't go to Merle Grove, don't go to Mona. Do Hi, good night. I'm calling from St. Thomas. Yes. Are you doing any giveaway from St. Thomas? Um, please listen carefully. I am going by school. So each time I call out of school, I'm now calling for somebody from Mona High School. So if somebody from Okay, okay alright. And student, if you don't need a tablet, or you don't need any form of help, your parent is good, don't call. Let somebody who cannot afford it or own in, who is in need call, all right? All right. I remember, guys, to log on over to Birds, follow Birds on all social media platforms. They are giving away $15,000 um, grants and 10 eh? And five um, um, laptops plus other gadgets, etc. All right. Hold on. Hold on. So, then better go to school. All right. So we're taking call from Mona, and if I don't get any call from Mona, we going to move to a different school. Yeah, all right, give them time. Let them a try. Got the phone. No texting, planker people, students. Please only calls. All right? All right. Only students from Mona. Hmm? Any one of them. Anyone. Yeah. Tomorrow, I start out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. School really need to open. Kiss my teeth. Um, I'm going to leave from Mona. We're still away from the Mona call. And we're going to go to a different school. All right? All right. Yeah. Are you ready again? No, you not. You, Natalie, Tina, Tats. You get your one already? Mm -hmm. Tats and Natalie. Tina take up your one already. Tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow. Hold on there. Yeah. Alright, we can go back to the live show now. I wanna do a fee shy. Um hold on. Hold on the planker shop. We don't want the live get boring enough. You know. Eh? Yeah, me make sure I'm a count. Remember I thought that say should I give me a clean page. Yeah, they, they will get the first one. Mm -hmm. All right, so Auntie got, I go to Planka School. <laughs> All right, All right love you tomorrow. Two, yeah, so number two, yeah, because I'm going to start out here, bird paper fair. Eh? All right, move on to the, yeah. All right. I can't live in Mountain View. I go to Port Lico, I go out of Port School. I give more a student a chance to come. I don't know if my phone is slow or what happened. Hold on. Mona High School. No Mona High School student not there yet. Post numbers to call 5600710. Oh, sorry. 5600710. Seven one zero. I never remember. So I'm gonna give out the the number. All right. So we're gonna call another school now. If we're gonna get, let me give them time for call. Five six zero zero. God of Christ. God of Christ. What go on? All right, Mona. You know what I told them, Mona. Um, oh, what go on to them? How can I breathe blue here now in this night here? 
Oh, you say, yeah, yell me out. Yeah, I'm from Katsa around there, so. Yeah, when I'm Third Avenue, back of my house, there, so. But see, I told them, you know, I told them I got a uh, tin set and something for the rat teachers in them house. And you say that I get back to me. Sorry, Planka shop. Give me a minute. Me a dozen yeah, in the house. Come say hi to the Planka, then, no? God, that guy is man and everybody. Come on. Morning. Yeah. That's that. Me too. This me set this away. Me want to move it. And then me go look cute today, no brother. <laughs> what, brother? <Dada? laughs> yeah. Yeah, man. Nice, look everybody. Yeah. Me guess what? Me da go make one look come. Ratty grandfather say, him go up there go do. Him do mixture. Yeah, him say it have to mix like so. Ay 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 ay. Me see me give me today. Brother, that be the feel. You know, take your fine time. Me, me never, why me come to? Because I never hear back from you. And me oh, because you already said that. I will left that bag there. What that? See, that's my they bring pencils and book. You yeah, know? You left that. Mm. You already say you're going to get back to me to discuss it with them. This is a wish dear. Wish dear yeah, because I'm here around the light switch. Mm. A leak. And that is dangerous. Yeah. So him did that tell me say you know if you use it, so he would have do it for me. That method, that's what I answer the mixture, that method. Yeah, I was right. tell him then. But mm -hmm. see if you could have dropped by because I'm saying he can't do it. Can't say him do also a leak so too. Well I told them it tore off the whole at Chishana home. And it cost me sixty something thousand. Sixty nine or sixty eight. Then by the job they saw. If I know when he's gonna do it, I'm gonna make better I know so the laptop. No, me I say if you could have tell him how to do it, how to mix it, give him the method then. Because yeah, I, I see them number, yard. Yeah, no, I don't have no number for nobody up there. I will never do it. Never shout you and try me. Yeah, because we have an echo woman, no. Yeah, because curfew. The curfew hours. Sorry about that plan, Kasha. So I never shout you. Yeah, and all right, call Paula. I call Paula to your shy and mother number. Mm -hmm. And she can get to him for you. Right. And make you talk to him about it. If rain falls in there, it not, it not leak like bad like no, what you shine that one. It a drip. No. The water a soak. It's because they never wet the top like how we tell them to wet it. Yeah, that one. Yeah. It, it, it and to it so high to all the picnic, they never want them to go drop off. Yeah, because yeah, yeah, today the man finished the tiling too. Up there. So the tiling though, I just wait for the grill man. Up, watch out, I think I'm going to do it for the woman. You know? Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? No man, no. Oh, 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 you are going to go away. Yeah man, I do, I mean, you have a thing named International Day of Praise. Mm. Day by day. Oh, in that when? October? No, in September. So we have a minister. I told you the curfew because the man who that come, come do the, uh, the, the grill come start it all. Because they stop him, the, he have a house a grill and he stop the house, the Dumasia house. So he put him back on Chishana grill. So he, he can't put off the people them no more. So he said, through the curfew, hold him up back again. He, he might go try to make me get the grill next week. So, the, stair, the, the, the staircase room. and the back staircase. So I can't put the people in the house. I'll do them asleep in there. They live in there yeah, now. Yeah, the security. Yeah, yeah this, me can't right? officially say, soon the house yeah, and the grill not put up. So I hit me up and so I call him to them and say, I'm going to try to make me get it Wednesday. Come up Wednesday and work overnight and make me get it for the weekend. But I will make you know. Yeah, man. If I want the grill go in my garden. Because yeah. Prince of the Amin are there. Alright. Yeah. yeah. Blessings. Alright. Yeah. Alright, sir. I am blessed up. I want to drive good and take care. Alright. Yes. Alright. Um. Alright, so we are go back to this day. Um. The school now. We don't get nobody from Mona, so we're going to go to KT. KT means Kingston Technical, alright? We don't get nobody, you know, so people in a car. I'm going to try back the number here, because this call how much time. You see, I wish if I'm Mona, somebody call how much time. Yes, good night. Auntie Dana, I see you calling a lot of time. Auntie Dana, I yeah. don't call RJ, I guess it's school. <laughs> no, I don't know them school there yet. I'm going to call out, man. I'm going to call some school. Alright, Auntie Dana. Yeah. 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 Your mommy, your mommy is right there with you? Yes. 
Me never say KC, me say KT, Kingston Technical, yeah. Um, what school you go to? I'm from Mona. You're from Mona, wow. Um, what is the principal name for Mona High School? Well, and, uh, you hear the question? No. Okay, first I ask you if your mommy is there with you. Yes. And I ask you, I, I you say, actually, she hang up. Let me see if I tongue tied she get to. She hang up. Let me see. All right, parents make it sense. Them listen. She hang up. Let me see if she go call back. Mona in the house. Lord God, me just. Good night. Hello? 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 Yes, good night. Good night. My name is Asha Williams. I'm, um, I'm, I'm calling from Katie. Okay. Alright, and where is Kingston Technical High School? In town area. Where in town? So, um, Kingston. <laughs> Alright, so. Uh, let me ask you a little bit about your school. What is the principal name for Katie? The principal name. Yeah. You know, say, um, when I remember the principal name, but I have my ID and some of them. Uniform. Holland. So, you, how old are you? I'm 14 years old. And how long are you going to KT? About two years? Yeah, yeah. And you want to tell me, say, in the two, two years where you got KT, you don't know your principal name? We didn't know it one time, but, um, you know, yeah, I think he knew, yeah. But other one didn't come here, I think. No, sir, me, that is a big no-no. I -no. can't give a present for your school where you go and you don't know your principal name. That is vital. That is very important. You're supposed to know the name of your principal for your school. Your principal is like the prime minister for your school, you know. So you must know the principal name. So I'm going to make you go think about the principal name and call me back. Uh, yes. Thank you. Yes. Students, you don't have to have to dip on P's and Q's, you know. You don't know what Auntie Dana. How many forgot you your present now? You go to KT and you don't know your principal name. That are the first thing you're supposed to, if you never know the teacher them name, all of the teacher them name because basically you can't know. You're supposed to know the principal. And the vice principal, that's the truth, Blanca people. Mm? So, yeah, yeah, yes, that is very important. You, you're supposed to know the, uh, the, the even if you don't know Italian, your mother, if you know, even if you, you, your, your mother don't know it, you supposed to know it. All right? We could take our next call. Hello, good evening. Hi. Yes. yes, good evening. Auntie Dana here. Good, good, good night. Yes, yes. What school you go to? Mona High. I'm calling back because the credit was finished. Oh, your credit finished? Alright, so we have Mona High. Okay, so you, you what farm are you at Mona? Seven farm. Okay, seven. Yeah, seven, okay. So what is the principal name for Mona High School? All right, you are so correct because I know a little bit about Mona. Does Mona school have a dome? Repeat. Does Mona school have a dome? What a dome? <laughs> you don't know, anybody by here know what a dome is at a school? No. All right. Uh, let, me, uh, let, me, let me explain because it might be a me I tell you the wrong thing. When you enter into Mona School, right, you listening? Yeah. There's this big hall in the center of the field. What you call that? Uh, eh? Wanda. We go for devotion sometime and when school report you're going there. What? Eh? Yes. 
What you call over there? It, it is not, a, it, it don't shape like an auditorium, it more look like a dome. Yeah, yeah. Eh? Mona, yeah. one is not, it, it set, it have a, 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 a arch and look like a round circle. You don't know that? Yeah, it's a door. Eh? Yeah, it's a door. Okay. So it have one up there? Yes. All right. Well, oh, you never know. Some Mona school have one, and we go and, and when 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 um they do dancing in there, them do report there in there. Can you remember those things? I'm just going in first grade. Oh, you're just going there. Oh, sorry. I think you're seeing a seven farm. Or, oh, okay. So I can't ask you much about this school then. Alright, so what is your name? Kimura Curry. Oh, just your first name, I did one, Kimura. Hold on. So, Kimura, you have two choices a tablet or a $10,000 um, grant. Kimura, let me write down your name and your number. What you want? The t I, I, um, I'm going to give you your choice now. What you want, the tablet or the, or the voucher? Eh? The tablet. The tablet. Alright, Kimura, you go and get the tablet. Smaddy said I may call it wrong. I wonder if I'm here by your call it wrong. <laughs> a dar I me say do a miss a darm. I want me say. Me can't bother in a plank of shop. Alright, Kimura, you uh you you me not going um so this is number one and number two. Alright, Kimura. <laughs> Alright, Kimura, bless up yourself. You will hear from Auntie Dana, you hear? Alright? Yeah. Alright. I want a dharma radom. Because sometimes the teacher will. <laughs> You know, all along, I go up there, it's an auditorium, you know, but what me call it a da. A ra doom. A doom, me call it. Doom. Because I used to go over there, go beat my daughter over there. You understand? So, me, me know it hatch and round. So, I don't want nobody to go over there. Is that, yeah, you say dumb. No, darm. I saw me call it. You understand? I don't me call it. But the pity they know where I don't me. When well, she knew, so she don't know. Because I know when I'm in a school like me hand back. Because anywhere in the Chanel, when they are hide, or anywhere in there, saying they when they know that they may walk out, they want school and find it. Because I'm that type of mother. Anyway, good night. Hello? Oh, I'm not call out the nether school yet. Katie. A student from KT, please call because it's my the wrong choice of work. <laughs> if you are a teacher, you teach different. Alright, so we're getting a caller from KT tonight, Kingston Technical, for all of those who don't know. Hello, good night. Hello? Yes, yes, yes. Yes, good night. Hello. Yes, what good school night. your daughter go to? Um, Bishop Gibson High School. Who? Bishop Gibson High School. Bishop Gibson girls. High School. Hold on a second, eh? Yeah, what? Eh? Yeah. No, the question is only on the live. All right, so tell them no parents don't say no no year, not no the year argue it. No, Only no, on the no, line. No, no, no wriggle there nothing tonight. We don't go on home across you. Yeah. No, we don't know nothing. We don't know. I'll be the family. All right. Go on to this come here for an hour at night. That's for the life. Me have sit me and Then me have pick me at the best in the world in a mountain view, yeah. Look at the yes, I curse you. Hello, sorry about that. What, um, what, I, I, 
the pity them this trap there. If you want me to tell you people, if you pity them stay there, reach out. And you're so up on the live, you question them there. Ask me what goes in with and come out dry. When me fin one on Bow Riggle. Fanaban, good night. Hello? It's a person you're not ready for me. Let me take a next call. Somebody from KT, good night. Yes, good evening. Yes. What school are you calling from? Yes. Huh? Yes. Yeah, what school you go to? Who? Okay, parents, please listen. We're calling out the school them by the name and then you let the children them call. Secondly, please don't send any children here in the night a curfew time and no tablet no the year I give you. Alright? So, um, young man, I'm um, calling from um, KT school, yeah? Okay. Alright. Parents, please listen up. Uh. Yeah. Hello, good night. Hello? Yes, good night. Um, you, you, which school you go to? Kingston Technical. Are you did just call in the choir? Yes, yes, I So, Joshua, I will tell you any of my principal now. Nobody has said any of me. Just, um, me and I try to be a woman. Alright, so, Joshua. <laughs> Um, what color uniform we go to Kingston Technical? Um, I don't go on home, no, please me, I beg you not to put a knife here, sir. Can you not argue it tonight? Yeah, mm -hmm. um, um, I think I'm broad. So how you got KT and you don't know your uniform? Call me back again, I don't go give it tonight. Something fishy. Who oh, him you got KT and him think I'm brown? Oh, strap long cap. You no be fear and call in. Make we switch from, make we get the next. You got a kid here, you think I'm brown. Hello, good night. Hello, good night. <laughs> good night. How are you? I am fine, same thing, I'm brown. Yes. So you don't know you're clear, you want to you wear. Okay, good night. Hello. Hello? Hi, ah, yes, good night. Auntie Dana here. I have the same name as my aunt. Yes, what school are you calling from? Clarendon College. Okay, no, we're dealing with Katie. Huh? No, we're dealing with it. When I call out the school then, you're calling. I don't understand. No, I'm, I'm, I'm giving away stuff, but I'm calling from a school. So whenever I call out a name of a school, then you can call in if you attend that school. We want to do it different from everybody else. Oh, so how do I know if you call the school? You have to name? watch. You have to watch the program now and listen for the school. And the number to call in is 5600710. All right. What do I press to watch the program? You have to, so all you know about the program now? Well, my aunt sent me the, the number. Okay, so it's teaching you my cooking skills on Facebook. All right. I'm not on Facebook. Okay, well, you cannot enter then. You have to, have, you have to be watching it to listen for the school or make your, your aunt inform you. All right? Okay. Yeah. Thank, Thank you. you. No, that little boy I met me night. He don't know where principal them. And then he don't know where color uniform in where go to school. Eh? Oh, yeah, go to school. I tell you, 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 I Good night, Auntie Dan. I'm calling some man because I can't I I don't know the color of your uniform. We're going to change this school. I'm calling for money, but I'm not going to 
Don't be a gay. You have to want to know what's going on. Don't let him waste the time. Uh, <laughs> Alright. Okay, love you. Yes. Alright, we can leave Katie. We can leave Katie. We leave Katie. No, so well, lad. May I get so much message? Um, we go to Vauxhall High School. Mount a camera and a Vauxhall. Hello. Hello. Good night. Hello. Good night. Hold on a second. You have to turn off the live when you're calling. Hello? Wanna oh, please turn off the life now make these children them call Voxal? Voxal, we're only taking the call them from the student them now, you know. We don't want the parents them call. Hello, good night. Yes, good night. Yes, we know it has a dome because the principal or the teacher, I think Miss Rodney did say it was a dome. Miss Rodney was a guidance counselor up there, huh? And a dean of discipline. No, she was the dean of discipline. So you are correct. It was called a dome. Yes. All right. Okay. Yes. Yes. All right. So we're going to Vauxhall. Look at Vauxhall High School. If you're watching. Five six zero zero seven one zero. All right. We know one. Hello. Good night. Hello. Is that, hello. Pick the person for now. Like, hello. Okay. We're not ready for call or no call. Hello, good night. Yes, good night. Yes. Yes. No, we don't have any tablets like that. We, we just have a couple of tablets and we're calling out school's name. All right. Please tell you no. Listen to what I'm saying. Tell your mommy to listen. Don't give her the phone to call and ask me. I am giving out some tablet and I am calling it out by schools for now. All right. Yes. Why these parents not obey the rules, man? Why do they not obey the rules and don't put the picture them on the phone for come back? Make me work out it, I go now. We not. We not. Um, lick out no school. Anybody can reach to my feet or get the voucher. People will travel anywhere to get something. Hello, good night. Hello. Yes, good night. How are you? I am fine. Yes. And you're calling? I'm calling about the Vauxhall question. You are you a student at Vauxhall? I am a past Yes, I we're dealing with only students. Children. Only children? Yes. Uh, Alright, thank you. Yes. No past students or adults from Vauxhall, please. Only the children then. Hello, good night. Good night. Yes, good night. This is Auntie Dana. Speaking. Yes, I'm sorry. I'll be my son. Here is me. What school he goes to? Oh, him, him just start to, him, him just start go to Vauxhall. Yes. Okay, put him on the phone. Hi. Hi. Good night. Good night. Auntie Dana here. I'm Amani. Hi, Amani. So I hear that you, 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 you I hear that you, you're gonna start to go to Vauxhall. Yes. Was Vauxhall your school of choice, or you were placed there? Please. Okay, you were placed there. Okay, that's fine. So, um, um, do you go and do your orientation already? Monday. 
Okay, you're going in Monday. So you know anything about your school, like what color uniform the girls gonna wear? Yeah. And what uniform are you gonna wear? Huh? Uh. Boys gonna wear khaki? Yes. It's not gray and white? No. You sure? Yes. Eh? Yes. I think the boys wear gray and white. Yes. You said six farm. Okay, the, the, the six farm wear gray and white. Yes. Okay. So what is it? Um Okay. So you want I'm going to give out a uh, um a uh, uh, give I will give you a $10,000 grant or a tablet. Which one of them you want to choose? Tablet. The tablet. Yes. Okay. So you you you, you sign up you have any formal identification to tell and then are your paper that to show that you're going to Vaxal? Yes. Okay, so tell me your name. Let me write down your number. Don't, don't spell out your number. I'm writing it down. What's your name? Amani Bertie. Amani? Bertie. All right, Amani. And this is your number, right? And you with that tablet, so we can't give you any more tablet yet. All right, so make, make sure your number is correct. Yes, bless you, Amani. This is your friend from the auntie, my nephew. This the is that the slippers. Do you remember her? Your friend was selling me the slippers. Your family is Lee's sovereign. Oh, Lee's up a sovereign. Yes, you remember her. Pick up yourself. He's my nephew. Okay, what did you sell me the slippers at the time? Right. Same one, auntie. Love me, you. I remember you directly because so much people me meet each time. And I remember you clearly though. Alright, bless you. Bless you, Auntie, and thank you so much. Yes. So this is Armani. We have Kimura and we have um Shivana. So we have three. Alright. One more call. Alright, let me choose our next school. So we go Vaxal. We go Mona. Mountain View Primary. So I'm gonna give a student from Mountain View Primary ten thousand dollar in book voucher right there in Wellington Town at Book Depot. So if you go to Mountain View Primary, please call in Mountain View Primary. Hello, good night. Good night. Yes. Um, my name is Annalise. Yes, and what school you go to? Okay, we don't reach to St. Hughes High School yet. So we want a student from Mountain View Primary. We're going by school. Okay. All right. All right. We're going to choose some everywhere, no worry. And if you don't know something, I'm going to make the grant them go up, you know. But we have all $15,000 grant too. Mountain View Primary. Hello, good night. Hello. Hello, good night. Hello. Yes, good night. Hello. Yes, good night. Hello. Yes. Where school you go to? Hello. Hello? Alright, if you're shy, don't call. So we're going to have one of the nights where, where, where past students from each school can. So we're going to have three days with a lockdown. So we're going to use that some of them time there. For, for, for past students, like when we're on the plank of shop, I watch. And when I go to say, Auntie, and me want to bless somebody from Immaculate. Daculate or so which pool in the youth to go. So we are gonna nice it up. So tonight me I do it that way here. So we're gonna have option to choose which student. So if you use a past school, a KCR, JCR, MACR, AC, you have options to call in and say, Auntie Dana, 
I want to bless my school. You understand? And it don't have nothing to do with me. Me want to bless a student from my school. So me can go say, all right, you can bless your student from your school. So that's how we are doing. Hello, good night. Yes, Auntie Dana, yes. Yes, good night. Oh, we don't reach to KC yet. We're calling out Mountain View Primary. Okay. All right. But that you call Auntie Dana, Auntie Dana. No, ma'am, we don't see that talk, say, if a KC, if a JC. You understand me? Never did call it. Sorry. All right. Yeah. So we're going to have one night where this past student, them, can bless somebody where I go, where I go for them school where them used to go. So, uh, and that now no, have no limit. You are going to know, remember we not give no cash. So if you say, all right, Auntie Dana, I want to give somebody a 15,000 or a 20,000 or a 10,000, we are going to send it to me, me go to the, the bookstore, and then I'm going to give a voucher, I want to send it directly to the bookstore. You understand? All right, I will do it. And we get the voucher then. All right, so we are take the student them now. We are not take no, no foreign call, because no foreign call night tonight. So if you if have if a foreign call, nobody will call. So we are work with the student and nobody are Mountain View Primary. Hello, good night. Good night. Yes, good night. Your mommy or your daddy is there? Yes. Okay, speak up a little loud for Auntie Dana. What yes. school you go to? Mountain View Primary. Mountain View Primary? Okay, and what grade are you in? You are in grade two, and what is your name? Mina, yeah, you talk up a little loud for Auntie now. No, yeah, Rose time. Okay, and, and, and what color uniform does Mountain View primary students wear? Blue and white. Blue and white, and what is your teacher name? Miss Thompson. Okay. So I am going to give you a $10,000 voucher where you can get your books, etc. to go back to school. This is your number, right? Yes, Auntie. And what you say your name is? Zoe Rostan. Okay, Zoe. Z-O. Hold on a second. Let me write. Um, Z. Z-O. Y A. Oh, Zaya. Yes. Okay, Zaya. All right. Are you going to get $10,000 voucher? All right. So I'm going to have one, two voucher, two tablets. All right, Zaya, you're going to get a, a, a call from Auntie Dana. Yes, Auntie. All right. All right. So. I don't know which one of number is for, um, for, 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 um, so, and then I just think I'm trying to remember the school then. <laughs> Hello, good night. Hello, good night. Oh, Jesus. Uh, I'm trying to remember school. We forgot. Above rocks, all age. That are my school when we used to go. We not even did member. So we want to get somebody from above rocks for a ten thousand dollar um back to school grant. So we're gonna need a student from above rocks, all age, to call in, and the number is five six zero zero seven one zero. Five six zero zero seven one zero. So we're taking that call from above rocks. All right. Yeah. Hello. Good night. Yes. Good night. Good night. Yes. Miss, did you? Miss, you said I am biased, right? 
I am just choosing school randomly. I am calling out to students. And I just call out above Rocks High School. Please sit back and watch the plank show and allow Auntie Dana to run this. Alright? And I only want students to call me now, no adult. Alright? Because you just come on the live and you go and tell me send me bias because why me don't call above rocks and I call above rocks and you don't know and you accuse me. Alright? Yeah, but you just come and tell me that I am biased and none of these school and me. Alright, just let the children them call in. Please and thanks. Yeah. So we're taking a call from above rocks, alright? Hi, Auntie Dana here, good night. Auntie Dana, I'm here. 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 i am here 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 i Yes. Yes, good night. Which school you go to? Saint Mary's. Uh, that I wish part that day. Oh yes, I saw it name. I'm above rocks all age. The district start doing that. You can't box me. For school when me go to me no member where name. Keep your little kid quiet, little boy. You forget box man. You want to tell me you got above rock school and you have four that talk about above rock all age. The place named above rock. The school name said me. He named me. You chat too much and I don't know when you chat good things. Keep your mouth quiet. Eh? What are this grace pump you, 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 you pass school? You have four that talk about above rock all age. Behave yourself, man. I know your school, you was a little boy for the racket. Start to watch me, was a little boy. The one tell me, me go upset. What a little boy do a move coming up and ask you no question. I want you a prize. For if me go above rocks, grow up above rocks. I'm going to set me with all age and come in at school and call it Bob Rocks all age. All right, little boy, what is your name? Conroy. Conroy? Conroy Kushni. Conroy Kushni. Boy, I'm going to ask you nothing more, Baba. If I'm going to be a member of the school, you set me with all age and I'm going to ask you I wish part that day. Well, on the Conroy, with my blunder, I can't go ask you nothing. Right. Oh, Conrad? Yes. Alright, hold on. Let me put on Conrad's name to Rasta Ja. Because I beat the one down at KT look while yeah. Because Planka people. Alright, Conrad, Auntie Dana gonna give you a ten thousand dollar voucher for you to get back to school. So you're gonna hear from Auntie Dana. Alright? Alright. What a shame star Jones. I asked the little boy where the school is there. Then me says, Mother from above rocks all age. The school name St. Mary's all age into the district of above rocks, P.O. St. Catherine. You shit, Jesus Christ! I shame. Why am I not for trouble? No more picnic on ya. Eh? He said, Beat me, man. What a disgrace to a power above rocks. Me have to fly the flag low. Star Jones, eh? Star Jones, what a Sydney to where we come my from the same school, same district. And then I have to phone ask the little boy where St. Mary is all here, Jeffy, they are St. Mary. Murder! This year, I don't know what happened in my shop here tonight. Me have to go give one trap. Hello, good night. Hello? Hello? Yes, good night. Good night. <laughs> good night. My name is Kalim. I'm calling from St. Mary's College. Okay, we don't reach there so yet. We just do um, St. Mary's all age. We have the college and we have the all age. 
<laughs> All right, no, sir, what a shame. Me can't believe me that phone at the school where me go to. The long stairs where me run up. Eh? Upstairs and downstairs and down high cemetery and pass. Me can't remember the down the name St. Mary's all age. What a shame. Mm -mm. No, sir. All right, I could go to another school now. So I come from up a country. In a mini mine, I'm all catch a right. No call it, but me give out another school. Let me tell you, if you even coming from country, plank of people, students, and then I'm going to make sure you get to the bus here to go back and come. So I don't want to know if you don't come for $10,000, say. If $10,000 alone, I'm going to drive to town for. Or $10,000, I'm going to drive to country for. Because I don't know, I so want to come to plank of shop. Plank of shop, things run different. So no care you no know, hear me a call out for school. Nobody fret. You don't go on no no reach. Alright, let me see which way I'm for going now. Me see Coco. I'm gonna go to Tivoli. Cause Coco come from Tivoli. Cause I can't remember the school then. Where I where school and on Tivoli name? Well, uh, give me a school in a Tivoli. All right, Tivoli Garden High School. Somebody from Tivoli called me. Can I can't remember the past school in my brain no young again. Tivoli Garden. Oh, what kind of school? Primary or high school? All right. All right. Tivoli what? All right. Tivoli. Are, no, we have to choose one. Tivoli High School. Let's see how much we got. One, one, two, three, four, five. Tivoli High School. We are going to every. Hello, good night. If you're not called from Tib hello, good night. Hello? Yes, good night. Okay, I'll take that All right, hold on. Yes, good night. No, Joshua disqualify your type. <laughs> But Joshua don't know any color uniform when we don't know a principal. That's why I feel like Joshua don't know nothing about <laughs> But you must feel bad seeing, man. No, no box him. That means he don't know a principal name and don't know a uniform. Mother, that make me say. We have Joshua mother on the live and she's very upset saying so no don't know no question. You're teaching me. Mm -hmm. All right, make it no man. The other parents them need to hear where you say. Talk, man. Cause this parents can't hear this. Talk. Hold on. Hold on. No, Joshua, mother want to say something. Go ahead. Yes. Yeah. As I say, every day when we say we say study your book, take your book, in pay, be a free fire, be a hours a night, time. No man. man. Hold on, stick up in there. Hold on, stick up in there. I'm going to interject. You say, when you say to him, say, take book up here, give him a so. Where you the parents come in now? Joshua, no fear. you no fear listen and watch what Joshua do, you know. You ask the mother now for the pain foot. Because you see, when my son or my picnic them did there, yeah? then they have online class, but then they have gadgets. You don't understand. They think you're going to lick him and beat him. No, you're not going to lick him. No, not at all. No. You understand where I come from? Yes. You don't understand. I don't want to lick him and ill treat him like how my mother grew up. I still don't know what you comment there. I can't type, you know. But I feel bad because even me feel bad. I need to go to the phone and call him and say, test your love card. Don't feel bad. Hold on, let me talk to you, little. Hold on, little. 
Because we have to do. Well, I don't kill him, no, I do him nothing. You have my auntie that I talk to you. Listen, me, listen. Children live what them learn. I'm going to listen. Listen to me clearly. Shh, well, I know. Just hold well, on. As a parent, our role is to guide the children, right? We have to set boundaries. That I'm telling you about me. We have to set boundaries. Boundaries, when you say yes, you mean yes. And when you say no, you mean no. When you say a bedtime, you feel like a jashim, yeah? You mean a whole heap of boundaries. Yes, it's true. School now nah, keep you know, I'm way out here on the life. I'm going to lower me in the figure up and look at something. I'm a me choose what Jashi watch. I set up him TV and him and, and him Netflix because my children them have him on Netflix and them control where him can see. Joshua can't put in any or anything for watch. We know the cycle, we know the show them when we watch. No, as, as a mother, a lot of the time we blame the child and we blame everybody and we blame the environment and we don't blame ourselves. We want what we want out of our children. And for you now, it seems to me that Joshua can't... When you... A Joshua, yeah. I need to like for me, Joshi. Yeah. It seems to me like... I'm not looking at my phone because I'm going to out where they must say in there. I talk to you, mother to mother now, because I can't talk because I'm a mother. It seems to me like Joshi can't, Joshua control you. That means if you tell Joshi, say, go up on the tablet and him go and go play a game. Your role as a mother is to put Joshi in the chair side of you, put up him tablet or whatever gadget you have to use and say, school, work, time. And you now go, if you have to work, you, you set a designated time where you know say a theme time this and if you can do it you allocate somebody in the house for sit with that him do it you understand a your responsibility so it look away now to you as a mother for the same calling for the program and you know what color uniform him wear and him don't know what the principal Well, I don't know where I'm school there. All right. You see my children them? Let me tell you how me give my children them. I mean, I bash no parents from here. When my children them are going to school, you see them hard cover notebook. I never sit down and make them write it up. I write up their name, my phone number, them school and them address, and them school address, and I want to look apart from the book, right? Me tell my children them which part them school there. Can emergency contact number. That means that I'm, I'm, we got to tell them when number bus if not, not, not them have to jump on a bus. Joshua is not a child like him, a baby, my 14, don't? Hold on. Huh? Joshua 14. And if. No. Because you allow him to full up him with the game. I might no, might be afraid. All right, here what happened now? Let me talk to you one and one as a mother to our next mother. You see, sometimes children, as I said, children live where they learn, and I hear a child, right? And might be. If him reach to this level, he's a 14 year old and he go to high school. No, ma, we don't reach to this, and we don't put him out there, so we do a picnic. No, not deal with him because you sound like you have to deal with him, like beating wise or roughing wise. That's not going to help. No, 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 no. 
Because you make the ass girl up through the gate and gone. Now, you can my grandmother said train up a child in the way him should grow. Me not say never train Joshua good, but to me it seems like you allow him to have too much free time. You allow him to do what him want to do. So when he reach to a certain age now, you can't bend the tree again because the bend the tree don't grow and get tall, so it not and bending. And to me, Joshua control you because me can't tell my son say what you're going to so go do your work. And me sit down with you, you know, going in there, you are go tell me now say I be a fool. Uh, Take where the phone from him then. And that would do last night because last night in you know, our hours, sit on a play game. And that would do take up, take up the phone, buy mash up phone, tablet, everything. I would say, try and look, forget a tablet from Monday morning because we don't know what's going on. And that thing, you know, some of you, but I'm not going to tell you like. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to feel about it, but don't make ignorance. Calm down. We stand up in front of me and I scratch him head and I tell him, hey, him, him. I no, 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 make ignorance to make your boxing. Lord Jesus, you make up. Yeah, but the comment I will only make you get agitated more and get upset more. Don't lick him. Cause that was, if you lick him, no, remember so that I'll abuse you abusing know. And you're going to get ignorant and you want to lick him more and lick him more and that not why help a child like that. When me feel like, if, um, uh, what is him average in a school? Why am school average? What is him average? I'm over 50. Eh? Yeah. Over 50 to 60, them average. That means him, him, him in the norm then, right? Yeah, you what? to be him shot because he's a boy and he's just that. You realize he must cut up for answer you. It's like he's not a priest, so you're going to ask him the question. They're like, you understand what I'm saying? How from? many children you have? You are the biggest one? Yes. So you work? Not right now, but I'm not um, ready. No, I mean, I mean so. All the time when he was him growing up there, you was a mother who go out to work? Yeah, I go out there to work, so I just don't know. All right, so who, who supervises him when you are not there? Normally, my stepfather or me would have been here. Yes, but no, me I talk say so when you're gonna work, is he a child that is left to fend on him own? Him, is he my child where all right, my mother gonna work and she left me and when you know she saw him up on the road, him is a, yeah, is a road child? Hold on, hold on, mommy, hold on there, hold on. Yeah, good night. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Hold on, me turn on the phone. Hold on. Me no say something like that. Hold on there. And a lot of hold on the planker people, it's not everything you can talk on the live. There are certain things that we can't talk on the live. Um, I know, I mean, acknowledge so that him is yet, there are some form of absentee parenting around him. And then, then, when these things happen, now, we blame the children them. We as the parents have to take our responsibility when we say that we bet. We, you see, some children person not saying you, right? We have the children and we leave them for fend for them own. That means, say, uh, you're gone, or you there road, or you're gone or work, or you left him with stepfather, stepfather, hold on, step. I'm not talking about ill treatment. I am talking about basic supervision. So you are the mother, him are the, you gonna work, him are the stepfather, him come out down the road with him friend him, or him gone there. So Joshua left pan him on him come out and him there at the lane with the boy and him and him there for the lane there so and him do as him like and him listen to big people argument and a big people to worry him in a, and a be a man in power with. So you cannot act. But you do not know who is associated himself with or who he might take influence from when you are not there in the child life i when i was live when my children them was living here ask anybody when know me them tell me say me grow my pit them like a foul cook because i set a certain standard and a certain rule that they are not supposed to be out in the lane with people them supposed to be in there and when me not there you used to have traits you used to have people who supervise them and know say if me gonna work 
one thing them father is like me. If me say to them father, say them are staying at the house, laddie are going to treat that them in there. And if him not there, we are going to get somebody else to come supervise them. So when the children them is left to fend and their owner are left as a street child or as a child where the mother gone there, so, and the father gone there, so, and them the, see them information in a phone or in a book. We can't do nothing more than blame ourselves. No, I don't want to hear that. I don't want to hear that. Because that is not no concern to me, whatever. But I am saying, you have to take the blame. You cannot beat him now when he's not alone. Because first thing foremost, as a mother, your responsibility is to look for his homework. You see, if me there, you have not no time for just your homework. I set up somebody for do homework. I set up somebody for go to school. Yeah, but all right. You, when last you take him up with him book and say, Jashi, you just say something like that. When last you take him up with him book, and you know, so when me in my bed at night time, because Jashi sleep most in the day, if you not sleep, him come with me in the van. We have him whole heap of book, the man him show me what him do, and me a, a correct him, and him a spell. So, word of me, so my little Jashi a spell. Eh? Yeah, but, but, yeah. Nobody can and nobody can talk to him because he reach a stage you now when him him now him, him, him a teenager you now in the stages where him a go go to school with brush in his pocket, groom up the ear, soon start pants and the body and you are the mother who alone. Cause my child, my son couldn't come through my gate with pants and the body coming and grow him so. Oh, my picnic them couldn't come through. Me, me I blame you. Honest to God, me not blame Joshua. I am not blaming him. I don't know why you feel no way. Listening to your talk, and you are the problem. You are the mother. Where your father there? Him father dead and stepfather. All right. So, Holy well, Papa, the father dead and then come out. A lot of the time, all right. Listen, a lot of the time, things that happen to our children, we are to be blamed. The father there, that is, that is something you can say, all right, because you have only papi you come up to something and then you have no father figure in them life. If him father dead, you are the mother. You're supposed to stand on your ground. Stand for your responsibility. I want the best for my child. My children, they're supposed to be. In a life, you know, I always stay at the back of the line and push up my tree, put them at the front. Anything, me rather me walk barefoot and tear up and them up there, them a focus on them book. Sometimes when I don't have no money, I go to school, go to trust homework. That means that I tell teachers, you know, I say trust homework. Teacher make them stay extra lesson till me get the money. I go hustle the money and come back and pay you. And, and if the teacher say that you are willing, a lot of the time, the teacher them say, say you are one good parent, you know, you say, boy, I'm, 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 that, you know, so that the parents, yeah, the mother, yeah, try, but you know, have no money for pay the extra lesson. The teacher go say, send her come because you used to have this teacher up at Shane school. And if me not have extra lesson money, she has sent Shane, she has sent her stop her from school, so. Nobody the people them wanna stop cause her because she I get defensive because I'm in her life in her course. You know? In her life of course. This stuff can you me Don't beat him. Blame yourself 50%, 70% tight. Blame yourself because you're the absentee mother. You're dead about your absent. You understand what I mean? Blame yourself. Don't rough him up. Things be you know what I mean I know dress up with pants on about you as well, you say? Clothes. And every day, my stepfather talk to him because I don't know where till him reach to that stage they know. But you cannot go ill treat him because after you make him go through the gate, you not try to draw him back when he done out in the road. Oh, God. Yes, but I don't want you to take out your frustration for him tonight and go beat him because the first thing you tell me is that you shot him in my box because you're shame. And no, and shutting him in my box now, now I go help him now. It only I go put things in him and put things in him. You know, if you go, pick, if you go finish licking him up after him live, but when you go read in I comment now, where them your planker people, where them finger now, no manners, or finger now, or baby, I go write up in I comment, and yeah, I go see it and I say, hey, te, 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 te. You understand? We need to stand up as a mother man. We need to put on with foot and up time to put them gone as tree up. And now we cause it. We as mother. I'm in a ramp with symmetry. I'm in a ramp with Joshi. 
But you don't know if I'm going to do that. Greatest thing you said that. At the way I'm going to and the pants are dropped down a waist and certain things. You don't know what I'm going to do because 14 year old a big boy. That's it. Take up the something off my fence. 14 year old a big boy. You understand? And if you say him a this and him a that and him no know nothing. Him, 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 all right. Him in him 60s and him 50s and him no know nothing. And you are going to be box him down in a night. Yeah. It can't help. And that take over him head, but you know so the game take over him head. Because with schoolwork, no, him, let me say if you give him a tablet now, if you do him schoolwork, but I put him for tight, up, 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 him now do no line work. That's why I beg the Prime Minister for open up back school. Because three quarters of September going down to January, no line work now go do her mother. Mother no say she no know for the line, father no know for the line, and most two of them are going to dry out there. Because if the, if the Prime Minister no do something about back to school right now, seriously, we are going to have a done sir, done sir, done sir at Jamaica. Because the same thing where you just said, who no understand line, them no understand line, and when they put him on line, I'm going to look for play a game. All right, ma'am. Yeah, man. I don't feel any way. And don't hit the child now because you see the people them in the comment are going away because remember social media and people free to say what they want to say. You understand? All right. God bless. Yeah. Wow. Parents. Me is a mother. Me is a past mother and a whole age mother now. And I just want to emphasize that. We, our pe we the mother, stepmother, adopted mother and grandmother, we are responsible for what our children them come out to be. Our me You cannot allow the children them to be who they want to be and the way they want to be. But when school time come, line work now, nah, I don't know. Three quarter line work, you yeah, know. One line, the Prime Minister, anybody I watch this, me I beg you know, especially for the inner city communities, is a out of a hundred, is 20% of them going to school. Because first thing, mother, I tell them to understand line. Second thing, them I tell them to no money for put on Wi Fi. Third thing, them can't do the work where them are put them for do. So the best thing for do is something for come up for them go back to school. Because in F I want how much you know, how much you know uh, with the this I gonna make two years and a two year what I done, Sarah and this I go on. And when the time pass for school, we cannot bring it back. Because if them lose two years, them lose two far more lesson. No line now nah, go on in a school. Because this child, him no want to hear nothing about no book. I be a game and I be a this. That's him no know him principal name, him no know what color uniform, and him used to be a good student. Nothing. Fans. Then give him the tablet to go up online and I close him and hang out. So I want to know, understand the government needs to implement something where school open back. Because me live in a inner city, me live in a ghetto. And 90% of the people them now go up no line. If you ask me, I close them and hang out. And this cannot go on. What I say? I just listened to this mother speak to me on the live. Her child, she had forgot all the work. She left him with baby stepfather. Stepfather come out, gone. She know that the boy the on him one. Him no go on no farmer line. No line in game gadget and a game them play. And I hear a lot of parents tell me to them give them picnic sitting for play pan. And when they look, the picnic they pan different sitting with the teacher not the pan. So the, I don't want to use the word illiterate or literacy, but a lot of the parents them, I may include myself, I can't help myself look, but a lot of these inner city community children, parents don't understand nothing if you go up on Zoom, don't understand nothing if you punch in nothing, don't understand nothing if you download nothing, or don't understand nothing if you send nothing to the printer them. You understand? So you cannot have a, a system, you understand the COVID, but something has to be done for these children in. And if you notice, I don't want nobody to say get to alone, because if you notice, three quarters of the high school students now are from our product of the ghetto. 
Mountain View, Windward Road, Excelsior, Denham Town, Rear Town, Downtown, all of them are passed out for top school. You understand? So, beating him now because I call him and he can't tell me the principal name or he can't tell me why uniform him wear or which part in school and not going to help. You understand? And she said, if he get the tablet, he not go up on the line. A big game, he go in a phone and play, she said. Because I'm not hearing, that means just him can't bend again. My grandmother always tell me, say, when we are come. See the tree, yeah? Bend it so from it little. Anywhere you want, the direction, the tree, if you go. You can't wait till the tree grow a bush up and tall up. And then you go try to bend it so, and bend it so the leaves stiff already, it cannot move. So, me I tell you tonight, parents, we are responsible for our children, our children well-being and them education. We feel held accountable for that. We feel held accountable. No supervision, nothing. Sometimes you look, sometimes I pass some place and I see one, one whole heap of woman that line up a gamble. I don't talk about you alone. Had an area. So while I go to my drive past and see one whole heap of woman lying table. Who not play a load, they play dice and they play throw things. What happened to feed them chick and all of those women? All of those women. You know, I passed the other day and I cry water come on my eye. I passed one of my recipient young child a gamble. I pass one of the child round table. I don't know if I play them or play with friends. But when I look, I see the little girl sit down with two other one round table. You understand? And I sat there in the van and I say, What will happen? It's so much mad that we say I do something with them picnic in a quarantine time, you know. In a back to school time, you know. They all bought their own gambling table and they all bought children on a road corner and them picnic and all learn nothing. They, they don't know nothing. School not keep. How much parents take up them book? When you go in at my house, go look and book in there. No care if you see me four or five times in a life. Me have thoughts. Joshua, I'm a picnic them. Joshua, I take him book and I send him a private tutor. Go make teacher teach him at the time. Me no love him up and send me around charity and I don't have no time for him. Parents, you are to be held accountable and be responsible. Responsible for what the children them come out to be. I mean, I mean, I talk. Me a mother, I mean, I talk. And me, but you should go do all kind of work. I mean, still find time for me picnic them. None of them can't come near them near Pambula. All of them all here, you know, them still a go to school. Them still the pan line and learn them align them work pan and them a go to school in a line. Me son in the army and until I go to school. So I not bash the mother tonight, but I am saying you are to be partially blamed for what your child come out to be and what your child do. And a lot of the time when things happen, we blame the government. And you lock down school. And you lock down school. How much we take the time out? And you lock down school for situation that we pick to get another teacher. I will find something to give the child to do. Give him work in a book then. You understand? So, don't blame the child now when he get in a spotlight now. Good night. And I call and I say, where well, your school principal name? And I say, where well, your school is? You go back so and beat the picnic. That is not the solution. And that could not be the solution. We have to blame ourselves. We have to blame we, the parents. So if school not open back, yes, Tommy, good night. Hello. Yeah, good night. I don't cuss Tommy, me just talk and I kind of feel and understand what she has said. And I understand that the child now nah, learn nothing. All right, here it is now. Um, and I'd like to speak to Joshua's mother. Mm -hmm. And whatever has happened tonight, it is not good for him and it's not good for you. True. And then we don't offer the blame game because obviously we know it's the parents' responsibility. So I'm going to say this to the mother, all right? First of all, 
Um, you said that his father is dead. That might affect him. Number two, have you stopped to think that perhaps Joshua is not an academic child and he might be practical? So if no, she said his grade was good. But because of the COVID, everything, she said was sixties, sometimes seventies. Because if she said it's so, not hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Mm -hmm. So we've gone through COVID, a whole year has passed and it is clear that his attention has shifted. Also, if she is struggling, the tablet that he has or whatever device, certainly it has parental control. So you can put a lock on games, you can disable certain things. If Joshua goes to school, not from them, you pick me at Tommy. In his area, you can't disable well, nothing from them. Finish, please. Of course you can. Samsung tablets, you can have parental control. A little girl that I used to look about, that was on it. My sister bought her a Samsung tablet, and it was controlled remotely. Anyway, so the solution, if Joshua has friends that goes to school, perhaps you can make them have a little study group where they're socially distanced so they can help out each other. You came on the live and you said you don't want Joshua to be brought up like the way you were brought up. So it is clear that there's an issue there. And tonight is possibly a godsend because your child needs intervention. Speak to the school as well and see if they can offer you any additional support. But do not hit your child. He's 14 years old and it might start. he might start to harbor resentment. I know say you're upset. I know say you're vexed. I know that times are hard. But you have to think about your child and about the relationship that you have with him. And Joshua, if you are listening, I am sorry about what has happened to you tonight. But listen, you have to pull up your trousers and you have to get serious. Your mother is trying and she's frustrated. So you need to get back to the drawing board and try to be a best, the best version of yourself. Okay? What the mother just said, no, Joshua know the tablet more than she. I ya say she can control tablet from him. Them ya pick me a control tablet from me and you. Them brain. Them pick me a. Mm? But, she's, but she's noticed what the problem is, and she is the parent. She is the parent. So she has to. It looks like when she relinquished control, she has to regain that control. She is the parent. Yes, but Something has to give. You but, understand? But what she's basically so saying she, is that him reach a stage you now where him go on a road or him a follow a friend or him pants a drop down and them things there. So what I was trying to him he said to her that the tree look like he bend, he, 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 he grow already and can bend. Yeah, but she can't give up on a 14 No, year old. no. Giving up is not an option. And beating is not the other. So this is what I'm saying. Exactly. So this is what I'm saying. Now that she realizes just, you know, something simple tonight and this has happened, possibly, you know, you have to go apologize to him for like smacking him in the face and then on a sit down and you find out, like I said, if him if he's not academic, what more have to do with him hands? practical things try to find something that he's interested to take his attention off of the road try to bring him back to being that child that she had once that was you know getting decent enough grades you understand it's difficult for everybody but you can't fight fire with fire you true. understand mm -hmm. true and, and joshua mother if you're out there just send me a message just send me a message I'm willing to talk to Joshua for you. Yes, you thank you, Tommy. Why me can't do without you? Go for my little brother page, the little green page, and if you just send me a message, I'm willing to speak to you because I mean, I mean, I like any of this either for you or for him. And hmm. like I said, this is and a lot of parents out there. Listen to me. When I need to prioritize it's parents, meaning fathers and mothers, not mother alone. And if you have an older cousin, auntie, uncle, now is the time for people to join together in unison to help these children because they are struggling. True. They are really, really struggling. True. And what I noticed tonight, I don't want anybody to take offense, but a simple instruction, Ms. Dana said, I'm going to call out the names of schools and if you go to that school I wanted to call in yet even parents calling in with completely different schools so something wrong with understanding in Jamaica it looks like so when the country opened up but Andrea forgot to ask the parents them got school you understand 
it's just crazy but anyway joshua mother if you're out there send me a message and i'll try to speak to you and joshua because you know clearly he can be saved no don't give up he's only true, 14. True. all right okay no problem Cheers. all right thanks tommy i may go say it again parents you are responsible for your child it is your duty to see that you and ensure that you get the best for your children when we as a mother you know, we go take up and get pregnant you know everything in our life change for you when you become a mother you don't see things from out of your eyes again for yourself alone you are sitting a four i know so you have to think for yourself and you have to think for the child. You understand? Alright. Hello, good night. I never want to do no more calling about no tablet tonight. Yeah. We have to go do this. Hello, good night. I'm Yes, good night. How are you? I'm fine. Yes. I am fine. No, no, I'm not call can clarity yet. It did, lead, it did lead from calling to another subject with a discuss. So when we reach to that, my wait, my, my wait call. Now watch that little. Okay, Auntie Dana. All right. My auntie's been here watching the whole time, so I basically know everything. Okay, so you basically know. All righty. All right, yes. I hope we get back at that kind of the little bit steamy. I have like Alex 20 minutes, 30, 29 minutes, 39 minutes for the live. I come off 9 o'clock. Alright, so, which school did just call out? Tivale. Or we are seeing somebody from Tivale. Alright, hold on. Oh Jesus, hold on a second. Hello, good night. Good night, thank you, Dana. Yes. Um, just to say what um, Tommy is saying, I know it's not a part of this, but let me just say, because everybody is on the live now, there is an app by the name of Kids Slot, K-I-D-S-L-O-X. Yes. So when you download that, you can lock down any device they use, even the TV, any single thing. They just oh, it. wow, talk it again. Because I'm a Jamaican, that is what I use for my two kids' phone. So when me tell them, if you got tech book and they still have a phone, we just lock down the phone completely. Okay. So you can set alarms to do homework, ensure so them complete homework, if them complete, and you want to give them a five minute, they can set. What? I'm a Jamaican, they can use this. What is the app name again? Kids Slot. Kids Slot. Yes, yeah, so it's K I D S L O X. Flocks. Kids. No, kids. Are you hear me? It's kid S K I D Z S L O X. Yes, K I D Z S L O X. Kids lock. Kids lock. All right. And they can download it up here, the, the child's phone, and set it and lock down everything. When it's 8 o'clock, the phone shut down, they cannot turn it off. Okay. 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 Kids locks. All right, Planka people. So you can use that and control your kids' phone. All right. Yes, Thank you. Yes, Auntie. I forgot to see you today too. Um. Hello. Good night. Hello. Good night. Hello. Hello. Oh, Lord Jesus. Please don't know call. Turn off the live. Good night. All right. So we're at Tivoli School now. We could see if we can get back to normal programming. Can we have to have a whole discussion? But, um, and some of the parents too. We don't love lick the picnic them too much. The least little thing on a fire big lick. Hello, good night. Good night, Auntie Dana. Yeah. I don't know what's calling from KC. No, we don't reach a KC. We, we don't have a KC. We said Tivali. No, it's not technical when this is what I said it's called. It is not 
Okay. All right. No, no, we do with the Ativali. No, but I will get No, with the Ativali, no. Yes. Hello, good night. Hello? Yes. Yes. And Adriana. Hi, good night, Adriana. I'm from Tivali. Okay, go to Tivali. Uh, what, 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 is the name, what is the name of your principal? Mr. Johnson. Okay, Mr. Johnson, what farm or grade are you in? Oh, farm? No? A grade or a farm? farm? Our grade, third farm. Grade. Okay, what color uniform do you wear? Blue tunic, white, white shirt. With what color tie? Orange and black. <laughs> All right, so hold on a second. And what you want to be when you grow up? A teacher. Okay, you want to be a teacher. So um, since school has been closed, you do any online classes? Yes, I did Oh, you go online and do your class? Yes, but the tablet must show. Hold on a little second, let me write down something. So I'm going to have one, one, Two, three, four, five. Okay, and what is your name, you say? Adriana. All right, Tivali. Hi. Well, on, Adriana, let me take your details. Yeah. Yeah, tomorrow. All right, Adriana, so Auntie Dana, go and make you get a tablet here. Yeah? Thanks, Auntie Dana. All right. Adrian is called number six. All right, Adrian. All right, so we're going to give out. <laughs> All right, so. We're going to go Fletcher's Land. Which school there, Fletcher's Land? I no, remember in school, let me know. Me and my girl are fetcher than I mean. Um, Nadi in Japan, I soon answer you. Let me, me, me. Teacher called from Japan, let me hear what she has said. Yeah, Nadi in. Hi. That was my first time doing it. You know. Good night. Hi, how are you doing? Long time. I know I saw you. First, first time doing it. Back in the days. I mean, no, say, yeah, go call Kaya is a teacher in a Japan. <laughs> no, what? I'm not calling. Well, I'm calling because when I, as a Jamaican, I can tell some of the parents have no patience. Yes. No patience. They don't understand how to raise a child. And so when they are stressed, they take out everything on the, ch on the child. Mm -hmm. I don't know when Jamaica is. When, and it's not just Jamaica, but I'm talking about my country now. Yes. I don't know when they are going to learn to, to, be, to you know, know that raising a child takes a lot. And specifically now, this pandemic is not just affecting children. I mean, adults. Children are affected too. True. It's not an easy thing to learn online because that was not how they were, they were not born into this where they were learning online. And we are social beings we we, we we learn better and we behave better when we are social when we're able to socialize and not being able to do that it's not easy easy true I, as an adult i now have my online i now have training online since last year here in japan and i can't do it i did it last year i tried to training was last week and may not do it. I made up in my mind that I am not going to do it because personally I am struggling mentally and emotionally with the whole lot of I'm trying to get up and travel to Jamaica or 
not anywhere like I used to be. And yeah. it, is, it affects me. I don't want to go online and do nothing. It, it looks more difficult to me online because the only so part thing for me is that I'm not going to live. So, children are going to do different things now with the time and the girl just jump at them and slap them up because they're doing that sometimes they just want you to talk to them true. let them share how they are feeling too they have feelings too true 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 they have feelings i'm going through it too so yeah i'm not taking up your lifetime but i'm just saying that that adults need to be aware that it's not just them alone i go through this Everybody going through it. No matter if I'm a Christian or not. Because me as a Christian, let me tell you, if I never have God, I swear Mother God mad already with this pandemic. It is oh, rough. Jesus. Especially, it, it's rough. Ghana, let me tell you. Mm. Over here in Japan, a lot of persons gone back home. G- gone. Whoa. Back home. My friend, well, somebody that I met online here, she lives in the country and Two weeks ago, she just called me and she said, Nadine, I quit my job. I don't care about no money or anything. I'm going home. She's going back to Jamaica. Wow. And there are other who went back in August. Well, so it the, is it's not so, it's, so, so it's not back to norm there yet, Nadine? No, it's not back to norm. And persons in Jamaica may not... Every, well, not, let me not say persons in Jamaica. Everybody is dealing with it differently. So some persons, like for me, if I was in Jamaica, lockdown wouldn't bother me because me not like our road. Yeah. So, but others are stifling. They need to go out. They need to go somewhere. That's them. But for me, being home is perfect. Like right now, wouldn't mind if them could have locked down. I'm not come back out of house for another two months. So persons. <laughs> interesting. So here in in Japan, cause uh, this picture that you have up is a long time picture. Which picture that me and another girl? Yes. Oh yeah, that was in that's here in Japan, yeah. Oh it's a lot yeah, because that's that's twenty eight twenty Oh, because I see. No, because no. Why I ask is because me see within our crowd and nobody have a mask. So I was gonna ask if person still wearing mask there. Things for persons to get oxygen wow. outside of the hospital. See, we in Japan there. Eh? Why go on out here? It not so bad like Jamaica in terms of because Japan has a good health system, but Jamaica health system, boy, I'm sorry for the nurse, we never want to about that. Oh, okay. My heart just break for know that the, the government, I, I like my government personally, I'm not in the PNT JLP, whatever, but right now I think. They need to do something more with the hospitals, man. The, th- the nurses and the doctor is that never deserve more attention before they deserve it now. Oh, the nurses and the doctors. Yeah, man, them stressed and tired and I'm sure them don't raise them salary. Them need to do something for them. This is a lot and some of them don't go home for days. And their lives are at risk true, because they're true. dealing with severe That is true because I talk to a lot of nurses here. I talk to a lot of nurses here. A lot of them are planker. And even the other day, I was off the life for three days because I got through my little morning process. I you know a lot of nurses, especially from down by KPH to Auntie Dana, sometimes when we're tired and we sit down and you will listen to. And it, it, it's yeah. like it's frustrating. And then when me even I said to them, say, they must say to me, say, even the COVID world, it peep them now have no bed. Why I me mean, not know what you say? I talk to a plank of people, this program has, um, has put me with a lot of nurses and doctors. Would you believe hearing even abroad, but I'm talking about now, since the COVID gets so bad, a lot even the other day, some lady, she literally a cry, she said, she can't eat, she does, when she said one time she dip on the live, she, she, it is like she gone in a different world and she feel relaxed. So then they ask me, she and a couple one did ask me, say, I do Stay so long for the life, guy. Comfort them. Um, it's really stressful for the nurse, them and the yes. doctor, them out here for two. It is. Mm-hmm. It is, man. I'm a feeling for them. I saw this girl, it's this nursing sub. I think last week when I was checking the Jamaica Galena online, and she's pretty young. I'm sure she's younger than me. And she 
she was she to me you could hear the stress in her voice and they were asking how she come out she said sometimes she don't want to come she go to work because of her colleagues because she know them need the help the support so, yes yes and everybody try to support each other let me tell you guys me no know everybody is on the live because i'm not watching the live while i'm talking to you so i'm not seeing the comments and stuff mm -hmm. as a jamaica i live abroad and can you and, and i'm looking at my country from outside we need to do better and i'm going to say this even on this program i'm just going to talk about Antibana's program we see somebody make one comment not jump down on them like we're hug be sensitive to each other if we never used to be like that before in this season we need to be more sensitive have a human yes um, compassion stop knock down people and be little people and life is short if you never see it before it's clear now life is short and today you listen I say quite scary because I watch a lot of YouTube. As a YouTuber myself, I watch a lot of YouTube mainly to support the Jamaican and it helped me to laugh while I'm here. Outside of praying and stuff because God know sometimes we don't even have the strength to pray with how that's me and how I'm handling this. It may be different from you guys because you are with your family. I don't have no family. I've not been in Jamaica since 2019 when I visited. I can't see my mother, my brother, my sister, nobody. Me would have to just decide to come back home if I want to see them. But I can't come back to Japan, but I would have to come back and look for a job because my job is not going to hold this one for me. Mm -hmm. So just be kind to each other. You better you not say not. Don't be quick to jump down on somebody because some people just are hold on and a straw right now. True. Literally. In Japan, the suicide rate has always been high. But this year, the children are killing themselves. Jesus. No. And I'm talking from in, in um, kindergarten up to high school children. Them stress, them stress, them stress, them stress. And if me as a Christian stress, uh, listen to me. Me not, me not shame to talk about when me depressed or sign up because this is how I deal with it. Last, let me tell him, I have to call my manager and just express how we feel. You know, care, I'm very vocal, and my mental health comes before a dollar. Tam, um, Nadine, I, no hmm? cut you, maybe tell us, you remind me of Tammy yet? Tammy? Tammy in London? Yeah, because that's something you always used to talk. Yeah. Yeah, she has <laughs> your mind. Man, I just not really comment or so, but I watch the thing and mm -hmm. watch the program a lot. But just try to focus on like now I focus focusing on my channel because we don't know how long we got there in Japan. Mm -hmm. As we just wander around my family right now. So yes, yes. And if, if you see me come home, don't be surprised. Mm -hmm. But I just it's it I just wish we could just be more sensitive to people. Be more sensitive to each other. We just cloud on people, so we just and the worst thing I'm most the Jamaican. I know it is in our in our culture. We culturally, honestly, we are very aggressive. Uh, but aggression don't necessarily mean being disrespectful or belittling somebody. Yet sometimes you're just pushing people further into depression that they're already in. Yes. You know? Yes. So but just as I say today is a new day we could try it for some persons sadly it doesn't come naturally but let us try let us always think of how would i want to be treated yes. this is how i would want to be treated listen last week sunday i put up a video but i know some most of you guys will watch my video before that had subscribe i can tell and that's fine but mm -hmm. i did a video and so many persons have been calling me because of it because i was so as I said, stress right out my ball to my camp ball no more. I'm good right now. And I took myself up Sunday because I just feel like I'm going to suffocate. And I went into Tokyo into this park and I just walk. I just walk to clear my mind, talk to my father, let, me, let him know my feel. And then I just build a content on that. I just sat down and I talk on my channel exactly how I feel. Exactly what I was 
feeling. Yes, I broke down a little bit, but me not care, and that is another problem. Not full on, like I have full on. Yeah. Oh, you, you cut off, look why. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, in Jamaica we are full of pride and we don't want nobody knows so we are going through this sometime and we, we, we put on this front. Listen, if you're stressed, say you're stressed. Make somebody know. Talk about how you feel. True. It's a part of healing thing. You know, cry if you have a cry. Stop playing tough. You know, machine. You know, so just you, you let out how you feel and deal with it. Because we can't take this with that out. Take them in the like, True, it, true, it true. Precious. True, true. Life might be rough right now, but it's the it's the most precious thing that we have. True. Embrace it, enjoy it. So the stress compact it on a program and laugh and clean your teeth. Me love when you go on at Trishana. Uh, I just love your me love your she talk and me listen and me me laugh because she's funny to me. Yes, she's funny. Yes. But guys, you know, me could just be more supportive. Come go back to your TV All right, <laughs> bless you. Yes. But it, Yes, yeah, so sorry about that bit and kick it off by Nadine. But Nadine is a, one of my first, first time donors. She's a teacher in Japan. There's a group of them there. And as you hear, she said a lot of them coming home. And as she mentioned, the nurses, Blanca people, um, I don't know why so many nurses are attached to this program. But I, have, I never know that there were so many nurses. Uh, um, in Jamaica here watching because the other day when I was going through my little dilemma when Junior passed, you know, we kind of come out stronger now and I never I turn on the charity phone. There were so many nurses uh, reach out to Miss Paula and ask if Auntie Dana can just come on the line because them they are work and, them, and, and, and Paula said, why well, Auntie Dana frustrated? Auntie Dana I go through her morning. You know, when I talk to some of them, I see some of them message. They tell me say them frustrated, them they are work. It's like when them get their little break, they might be go somewhere, go sit down and then put up them phone and then watch and it take them off of the work vibes a little bit and a little bit and stuff like that. So. I could just remember the nurses them and keep them in our prayer. The nurses, the doctor, the the people them were push, the people them, the porter them, because the security guards at the hospital, all those people are running without fuel. And when I say Blanca people may have to come back with this whole thing one next night. I may have to continue it. I remember a six tablet me have, I'm gonna continue, I'm gonna come back with it. All these people are running without fuel. Security guard, why Miss Dana Menala, your program keep me up, keep me going, make me laugh and you know. These people are going the extra mile. You know, today I went downtown and I saw a lot of persons not wearing any masks in crowded spaces and in in, in um in, in old sale and I remember saying to a man this evening say why you not have on your mask are you out in a public lady if you want to wear your mask wear your mask and leave me alone I said when you do wear a mask you make it harder for somebody else because you can have on your mask you don't have on your mask so you come and you sneeze and you left the spot and you gone and me come there lean up on it and then me pick up something you know a lot of people if, well if I saw me for dead make me dead go on people not taking this covid genre this covid thing serious and it is serious but because we're there in our community and we don't see nobody a drop down and we only hear it from the news wait till it happened to you or somebody for you the nurses them the security guard the porter and the doctor them and them i go through it oxygen come at jamaica the other day i hear it only a last for two days People are wait for people for come off of oxygen for save for them life. And if them not take off the oxygen off of them, you can't get it. That means say you are go dead. This is serious. Then this evening me I come in the van and me hear them I say there got to be another vaccine, a third dose. Because all other variants are come up. Them have to go get another joke where whosoever get the two already. Them have to go get a next joke because look like the two where we get are like when me I go get two can't control the stem of the box or whatever coming up. It is serious. Me look, me see the nurse from the hospital died. Then me see this next man down there. Them a worker there and them catch it. Planka people, something is not right. End time is coming. So this this is not just a normal thing where this is not just to affect Jamaica or America. It is global. 
the whole world. Me and nurse tell me when night said she don't want to be nurse no more. She was crying on the phone. She said, Miss Donna, I don't want to be a nurse anymore. I'm sorry I chose this. Because I have to come out. I am frustrated. Them afraid to imagine you are gonna look for a patient, for a bed where have COVID, where I lose oxygen, while him lungs are go, him heart are go, this are go, and you know so I them him have something where you afraid of, and although you have on your shield, your mask, you are still afraid to go there. Because you are look on your life in a year and a few months on the bed. And a lot of people about the Prime Minister, I feel the Prime Minister, right, right now I said to Claudia them today, say, me feel say the Prime Minister for lock down the country for a three month trade. I mean, I say people now go suffer, make some farmer initiative say, all right, lock it down for this week and then next week you make people go get food or something. Because this thing's serious. People are coming and say, warm well, to poor people. Poor people are dead, rich people are dead. And I just one set of people are dead. Everybody are dead with it. The hospital them full. Somebody show me a video when night pan them phone, which is them not supposed to do it in one of the hospital. And plank of people make me tell on the water come on my eye. She said, and I look here. And when me look, a peach she said, be a COVID people, them they sit down up so then they the pan up bed. I a cheer them lean up so all boat and I work, she a working night. I, a patient them here will come in and then test the COVID. We don't have nowhere to put them. They don't have nowhere to put them in the hospital. You hear people are ball out. Whoa, whoa, me can't breathe. Nurse, nurse, nurse can't go. Can nurse not no bed to put them pan. Nurse can't go over go give them two little, they sit in the little pill them in their hand. The panadol or whatever it is that the government give them for give. They can't do nothing because they can't make oxygen. They don't have nowhere to put them. They don't have no What going to happen? This never happened in the whole entire Jamaica. I never see a hospital run out of oxygen. I never see. You don't tell me if I don't live in Jamaica. Anyone who ever see Jamaica run out of oxygen with hospital, I must something. You understand? Me see it with my two eyes and me I talk to a planker nurse and she said, Miss Dana, you know the panel life, just look here, just look here, just look now. And the people them now take it serious. Me can't me when I go home to my family, me have to turn up out in a some part in the yard and trip myself and be around the one back pipe and then go in. But because you don't see it happen to you in our community, our neighbor, or to somebody who don't know, who don't think there's nothing not there. In a taxi, you talk to them till like you're four passengers in the same way plus driver. It is serious. I never see this yet. And I went with the me and looked, I said, Jesus. So I said, oh, you know, all of those patients are COVID. She said, yes. People are bald. And when the worst thing with COVID are the, are the most, is the most dangerous sickness when it take you. And when you catch it, you don't see no family, no care who love you. And they have you on the hospital ward. Your husband, your wife, your daughter will love you so much. You can't come in, they can't look for you. you can't come hold you and, and sing lullaby to you and pray for you. Because they are exempt from coming in there. How oh, serious. I don't believe when a man made this effort. Even if a man made it, it is here. And Uno will go out there up and down freely, up and down, and do as you like, and I do this. And I, me, me, me tell you, I never even take it serious, Planka people. Me I tell you, when I just started, me, me I said, I can't come in here and this. But when I see my own father died of COVID, when I see people when I know catch COVID, when I see things that happen, when I see the hospital, them. Nurses, but there's somebody that showed me something. My friend, I think of England. Somebody there, yes, I watch some dance or something. We keep a foreign, and I say, Look, one crowd and jump and party can't keep ya. None of the people, them in there, have a mass in a crowd. I mean, yes, I take over back the whole of New York. It some state up a foreign, all bought me a COVID and lick down back the place. 
mm, if we don't take heed. No found us sitting in a vaccine, no one go take it. Make we make the place come back. Protect yourself. If everybody protect themselves, it's better. You protect yourself and you protect your neighbor, you protect your children, you protect somebody against you. The nurse and the doctor, them, what makes them give up and strike and say they're not going to the hospital? What makes them come out tomorrow and say every nurse and every doctor, every hospital worker, they pass strike because they're frustrated and say doctor, same strike tomorrow. What happened? If doctor come tomorrow morning and say we will have a strike, what happened? You know what happened? Funeral parlor open. If doctors get up tomorrow morning out of frustration and strike, and nurse fall back at them, porter fall back at them, cleaning staff fall back at them, a dead house open up. Hmm? If dead house open up. Never. And we can talk on this. Star Jones working at the dead house. Star Jones, you're dead on the life, you know. Hospital now, no space to put body. Hospital, if you rent out dead house now, if you take some of the body, then leave a COVID patient them. Where they're in the hospital now. Ask Star Jones because she working in the hospital, in the dead yard. Hospital now, no, if you pack up the body, then now they have book. Different, different mag. If you take some of the dead body them and when you look at young people them with nurse said to me say some young people are dead covid are lick them down 90 some of them government not even put in a paper for news again young young people lungs gone no oxygen to save their life and in a company radio when you don't see it on the newspaper as then dead, then tag them and throw them. As then dead, then tag them and say COVID. Because that it killed them. Some of them don't even get to reach for a bed. She said some of them dead in a chair. Come in a blue shot. A blue, a blue, a guan. So nothing not dead if you help them. Eh? It is serious, Blanca people. This is not a joke. When we say, me too. We always are telling us it cannot come. Right now it's rampant. All if me lock the door, it go through the grill. When me say to no. Eh? And on a joke thing this. The Prime Minister, him himself and the President him and the all kind of people, them don't know where to do. Them themselves don't know where to come out, come say. Them themselves don't know where to do. Because this year COVID, or whatever it is that is in the atmosphere at, 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 I make havoc all over the world they don't know what to do we don't know what to do the nurse and the doctor them where we are look up to where we are look for straight and where we are look for help we are dead too you know see young nurse are dead old nurse are dead doctor are dead all over the world then catch it to and then gone doctor never know what to give for covid I'll tell you, God, we're going to take Panadol and go take this and go take that. It is serious. It is serious, Planka people. No follow nobody. It is serious. Me used to write. Remember when Miss Richie did the hospital? I don't have anyone to remember. Miss Richie? Remember when Miss Richie did admit to the hospital? I could have gone on the wall and go in as I like and see people from bed. I never see nobody I go and lie down. I never see no patient and teach up all about in a chair. I saw the bed them juke up in there. One day I saw, one day I saw, one day I saw, one day I saw. And you can't enter in there. Because the doctor and nurse not enter nobody from the wall them to look for people. And if them do a take in one, a one smaddy a go in there. No care who you be, and no care who you have in there. If I your husband him a go dead, you no see him. If I your wife, she a go dead, you can't go in there, go hold her and 
rub her ear and pray over her. And if I your picnic where you got birth on your breast, and them sick with COVID in a hospital, you can't go in there. Then put them in an isolation. You know what that means? Uncle Doctor put on dead body going, dead people, who are dry out, body going there. So me I tell you no. Me I want you know with my platform, it is serious. Because what I see the other day through video calling, I saw a woman sit on a ball. Father God, help me. And I know all woman. A woman in her look like from the distance when I look through the phone, come here, look down the passageway. That woman can't be more in 31 30. I hear catch up in a one. I don't know if she dead if she living. I saw me see woman a wall and a ball to Jesus. This is serious. I'm mean, not talk with water in my mouth. It is serious. What I say? You understand? And even when you get vaccinated, you can't say you can't catch it. But it only build up your immune system that it don't affect you so much. As the person when you get vaccinated, it is serious. And I'm telling you, me feel free. No look up. When I tell you, the plank of people, what I saw Sunday night, a Sunday night, yes, what I saw Sunday night was no joke, was nothing COVID serious. When I see, when I say, me take me to where I see the, the corridor, line of people all about a ball. No, no bed for put them, but no, nothing for give them. I see, like, me, me see one woman with one back like this, I do so. That, me take me to a and sip in a hospital ward. One, one of them have one buckle. It look like a some water buckle, but a the long one. And I see the woman have a buckle over her mouth, I do so. I tell you, no. me see it as she talk about the nurse then. It is serious. We no take heed. We are no mask, but take on self. Take up on a vitamin C. Take up on a vitamin. Eat up on a kalalo. Things of a build up on your immune system. Take up on a zinc. When this this are the only sickness me ever see in my world. When it take you and you reach hospital, your family can't call up on you. You're dead alone. I you know sometimes people are dead and their family dead and they hold their hand and coax them and say, boy, I know your transition. When you are dead, none of them can't no care how much money you have, no care how much family you have, no care how much picnic you have. Them put you in an isolation, none of them can't come in there. No care you go and buy your doctor and nurse and say, me go see my wife for the last. Them are dead alone. Who no take heed. Who no take eat planka people this COVID year is not a joke. What me say? Because as she ta she never talk, I would remember if tell her no. Come here and me look at this spear. And she said, Auntie Dana, look here when you no come on the live. I'll be sit down and do I look for the sick people them. And hear them about. Take on a vitamin. You know, I'm going to listen to something. Because I tell you, I love informative things. And when I take up my, my love Google, it's my best friend on YouTube, Google things. I mean, I listen to this woman, I talk about um, Noni. And she has said, oh, Noni, good for your immune system. I don't know if you know her name, Noni. I mean, I Google the benefits of Noni when I sit where I grow up on a tree. She said, it's good. Take ginger, I'm buy a lime in a week, yeah. Lime and things with a bill on a system. 
and them things down of it. You but this and Tara. I uno now have to put on a life first. When COVID now, everybody I look. Parents can't help Pitney, Pitney can't help parents. If Pitney sick, you can't go in the hospital. If your mama sick, you can't go in there. Then where the sense? I don't know who passed here, because I don't have to phone me now, look. I never even look who I walk in a lane, God know. Because my brain is in a lane, you know, yeah? For plank of people, me I tell you, no, be careful. Be careful, be careful, be careful. Be careful. Be careful. Me say me I go get some. How many about one tree and me say the woman say it is very good. She said fresh she had drink only, she not even catch a sniff how much years now. And she said the benefits me, me never know how it, it, it draw how it do. But there's a lot of things. Orange, we see the orange where they are torn by uno orange. Uh, true juice have this 100 percent orange juice and not no night it good if you can go squeeze it for yourself you can buy it drink up on the fruits eat up on the fruits take on a vitamin because when you see when you got a doctor the fourth thing they ask you and as she tell me that it's zinc in your body i think they might give you so you can buy zinc and vitamin C and take them. It thinks you're immune. If you build it up, so if you even catch a cold, it flash it off. Bath. You understand? All of them want to hear me tell you about the vitamin. Them. Take them. Take them. Because enough people were dead gone, enough people were catch it. Them immune system weak. Some people don't believe in a vitamin. Me too never believe in it. You don't want to see me a man in time I take my vitamin. I don't want to see me and mix my smoothie. Tell them if I go look some spinach, I go get a price mark. Drink up on a smoothie, especially on a smoothie, on a juice, on a beetroot. You know. If you don't want to draw color, you have iron in it. You can make a green smoothie for every one time or two times. Juice, ginger, celery, a little color, a little kale, a little lime juice. And that is something for your immune system. You make that you strain it off or you drink it same way. If you blend that, you can blend out everything. Plank of people take care of yourself. Likewise, me. Anything I say for me, it go for one or two. You understand? Because what I see, I am not at liberty to tell you now which hospital right here in Kingston. But it wasn't a good. It worse than the one. When I see them, I show a man they for what I be wall. I see a woman that. So the woman I go with the buckle. With the buckle. I don't know where she I get, but my the oxygen she had tried dry in and dry out. Yeah, and she never talk about the nurse tonight. I would come on fire for say nothing. But me say this COVID here, it is serious. And all along me I talk about it. And when I me get like a sour stop juice to really collide me night. Yeah, all along me I talk about it, me never take it so serious. Mm -hmm. All along me I talk about it, me never take it so serious till me I see first and in depth because I plan to show me a whole heap of nurse and doctor will watch this. All if it go on and the life put on one side, I've then catch them break and go turn on it. Then go turn on it on the life. You see, you know, big up on yourself. Love on you know, God bless you. Know. Love on you know, from the bottom of my heart. I'm saying, you know, love, pray for you. Know. When they come off, I water, when they go get a work one hour break, then sit down. And then in a plank of shop. Mm -hmm. So I may have to live up to a certain standard. I say I can't make nobody draw me out on phone. I say I can't bring down myself to a certain level again like what I used to do. I say I can't take no chat in front of nobody. I made a good chip. I have to keep my head sound in the car. My head, what did I go chip? I keep people sane. I keep people focused. I give people enjoyment. So God placed me right here so, for a specific reason. I'm going to take either after nine, I'm going to go beat off myself. 
Drink a little ginger and turmeric tea. Because ginger used to burn me too much, you know. I don't know if I chew me, take my mind and fight. What I do, I make a ginger. I know the pot ginger them and the turmeric. At night time now, I start to make that. And I put a little lime in it. I buy lime with it. I'm going to get some more today. And honey. And sweeten it. I put no sugar in there. And I drink it. Mm -hmm. my, my, well, my, my, my friend said garlic oil good too. I feel drink garlic. Run up and down like your mother in there, man. Me and it's a J, yeah. And them sitting there, I take you. I don't want to have a mile of tea and have a last go again. So I tell you, no, no, take care of yourself. Protect on yourself because when it, 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 it virus take on you, all I want to kill up to it, how are that? How are pictures of the pile of bees? All I want to kill up, all I want to big friend them. All the people in the phone, where all the food, you know? All the people in the phone, where all this. Why you put the fuck them in the room? Yeah, they carry in. Yeah. All of who? All of no big friend them want to have on no man and everybody when they take on all them around from on. None of no man now come kiss on one on have COVID. None of no husband now come at once by the alone they say do that. But the woman name a foreign, I, the man of England, the actor man, his wife, catch it COVID with him and say she has F. If him catch it too, she has catch it, she has stick with him and never isolate. I be sorry, the, the, the actor guy. Anybody who want to do it and then you say, you have COVID, them and tell you, say, go in another room there, go isolate yourself. And then the, you have in the house, you want. Uh, yeah. So you know, stay there, you know, they love you. And then you them all around for you. You have COVID, stay far from me. You have to go isolate yourself. Take care. Take heed. Take heed, Blanca people. Bless upon yourself. Peace out. Nurse, doctor, and all of the hospital workers are praying for you tonight. Yeah. Have a blessed night. Students, I will come back another night. Not tonight. I'm going to be there now. And look for my baby. Alright? Bless up.